guys from every week to do the trick. Oh well, it's a little baby. And roll sound. I play Kat Valdez. She's a superstar, a global kind of superstar. She's strong and confident. She's a businesswoman. She's a boss. Um, and But also, she's just a regular person. At the opening of the movie, Kat is about to get married. She thinks her life is going to be one thing. She's doing this huge concert with her boyfriend of a couple years. And they just, you know, she thinks her life is like headed down this one path. And with, in one second, everything changes and it all falls apart. And obviously she blames herself for not seeing things, but makes a choice, uh, a very <laughs> kind of uh, spontaneous choice to marry somebody else in the audience. Um, and that's how she meets Charlie. Charlie's this laid back guy and who's, you know, a Luddite and, you know, happy with the, the, the kind of um, ritual of his life, you know, and um, I think Parker straddles that line between him and Kat in that she, you know, embraces, you know, um, the apps and the phone and the, you know, social media, but she's also a teacher here, you know, she's a peer of his, but she, she loves the pop culture world. You heard me scram! All right, now for the rest of you who know how to follow directions, I bring you the one and only. I love you. You can't imagine anyone but Jennifer Lopez playing this part just because it seems so perfect for her skill set. And just the other day, we we're doing a scene where she's you know, dancing with, um, with my students and uh, kind of leading them through some choreography. And usually, you know, making movies is kind of, can be a little bit tedious, but when they were doing that scene, everyone was watching the monitor, even the security guys, just because it's fun watching her dance. I don't know who would believe she would go from Bastion to me. Good point. Well, the fact is that she did go from Bastion to me. Counterpoint. Oh, my character in the movie Bastion, this, this, <laughs> this guy. Well, he's he's amazing. He's a lover. Um, he loves life. He loves his music. He's he's in love with his career, but he's also in love with with Cat, this older woman who who he feels that that she could be the the love of, of his life, right? But after that. Uh, he feels a lot of pressure, <laughs> and he started taking wrong decisions. What Maluma brings to Bastion is everything that Maluma is. He is attractive, he is talented, he's a hard worker, he speaks that Spanish. He was a real natural. I remember doing the first scene with him and going to the director and going, he's a natural, that's good. We get, it's not gonna be weird or awkward. It's not like you know he has studied acting his whole life or anything like that. This was just him really, doing it, but sometimes, you know, you don't get lucky. But we got really lucky because he was a really natural actor and he really understood what his role was. And, uh, and we had a lot of fun. I mean, it's his charisma, you know, that, you know, we needed somebody who could really pull off that they were a superstar, a, you know, a recording artist uh, who was easy on stage, who girls would go crazy for, who was, you know, believable as a cheater. <laughs> He hates that. He's like, you know, I'm not this guy. This is not who I am. Not Bastion. I go, no, I know, I know. <laughs> it's a new day. Woo! You know, Owen and I are so very different too, <laughs> which kind of worked for the characters really well. And it was just great, kind of getting together with him and hearing his perspective on, on Charlie and my kind of perspective on Kat and how different we thought about things. But at the end of the day, I think those differences is what the movie's about, and how different their lives are and how do you bring two people together that way. And um, we were really able to find, you know, kind of the connect with them, which is just 
everybody kind of just wants at the end of the day, no matter how big and you know famous you are, you just want a simple life. You want to be happy. You want to have love. You want to find love. And I think Owen and Kat both had that. And I think that's where Owen and I kind of really concentrated with the two with the two characters and were able to really create this wonderful chemistry.